Good morning, Wales. What a lovely morning in the mid, in the heart of Wales, in the middle here, in mid Wales. Um, so let's start by saying thank you ever so much for the turnout in Carmarthen on Friday. Well done, boys and girls, men and women, ladies and gentlemen, and for the turnout as well in Newtown yesterday. Excellent turnout. Um, we all seem to think that WG stands for Welsh Government. But it's obvious, it doesn't stand for Welsh Government. It stands for wasters and gutless. Wasters for all the money they've wasted on things that does not involve Wales. You know, even the Prime Ministers have stated they've wasted money. You know, and they spend money now, send money away now to a, a Uganda to plant trees. That's a waste of money. And after yesterday's event, the gutless as well. They wouldn't even talk to us people who was waiting for them to come out. So they sneaked out the back way and jumped in a cop car and away they went. These are the people in the running for Drakeford's job. But I'm sorry to tell you, I think they're all been brainwashed in the Senate with Drakeford. The st statistics say by 2050 we need 50% more food to what we have now. So why are we planting good productive land that produces the best food in the, not in the country but in the world where they need 50 percent more by 2050 why don't we improve the hillsides and be ahead of the game reduce carbon because gas soaks up more carbon than trees and increase the food production is this is what i've been saying all along um, you know i would have plenty of food by 2050 these people in the centre, they've never had college of life. They don't understand. They don't care about me, you, or nobody else in the country. All they're concerned about is their um, salaries and their pensions. Make sure they're okay. And these extra seats, probably for their mates, or more bloody cronies, to make more mess. So, come on, we've got to vote now against the centre, or change the people in the centre and have people who's got common sense. We are the common sense party. Don't forget that. We are the common sense party. You know, it's like the school holidays. Fine, they want to reduce it. But why don't they send the kids back to school a week earlier? Why point a finger on that first week where Welsh families go for a holiday at the Royal Welsh Show? That's their annual holiday. The only holiday most farmers have. Because the rest of the year, for the 51 weeks, they're bloody busy. If it's lambing, feeding, haymaking, whatever. Or even spreading slurry. You know, NVZ, waste of time. You know, nature, they're going on about nature. How did nature survive before these no-gooders came along? Actually, there was more nature about. Because farmers was improving land all over the place. Creating, attracting, as you say, more worms... Because you'll never see worms in stale, dead field, soils. You'll never see worms. But freshly um, ploughed land, um, improved land, you will always see worms. So that was bugs for the nature. So by leaving these fields under trees or set aside as habitat, you'll never get worms there. So there's no bugs there. For the um, for the nature, so it's people that doesn't understand nature. Nature will look after itself. It always has done, always will. You can't change it. So, come on now, we got to stick together, be strong together, and fight together. See you in Cardiff.